for some of us, we have anxiety and we have actual issues that we might need some, some help with. And I don't know if you have actually looked into maybe finding ways to manage that. But it would feel just like collections of and bursts of energy that you would feel chest to throat to head, but that are actually firing in various parts of your, your physical body. There is probably, I would say, uh, blockages or obstacles in the meridians of the, of the energies. So the pathways, the, the various pathways routing to all the different systems and interrelating, like we've got obstructions here causing uh, firings of energy, which are felt by you to some degree as anxiety. And so general relaxation would be fantastic. Um, generally taking it easy, not being too concerned about that. Well, that's easier said than done. So for somebody like you who have, who, who would seem to have these blockages, I would say go massage therapy. Hello. Get somebody's hand on your physical body. Let them move stuff around. The physical body is intricately connected to the energetic body and to the chakra system. And if you've got hands moving tissue, hands moving fluid, you are moving these energies around, and this is something that you need. Also, lymphatic drainage. So learn how to do the lymphatic drainage on yourself, but you could also seek out a practitioner who could help. And also, what is that called? Craniosacral? Craniosacral. Edgar Casey talked about it. Craniosacral. These just moving things around and unstucking stuck points. You would feel relief from that. So if you've got an actual physical thing happening, which is a bit beyond your control until you can adequately tend to it. So licensed massage therapy, an appointment that you keep, that you do regularly, would be great for you. Also, acupuncture, um, having somebody who knows what they're doing, working with these meridians and working on opening up pathways just so things can start flowing. Tai Chi, Qi Gong practices, which, it, which are moving energy around, would be really, really great for you. Um, this is the more traditional physical aspect of what I'm seeing. So these are things that you could do in addition to potentially maybe considering a medication. I, don't, I hate to do that, but you, 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 you are, you're at a level where you might benefit from this. So if you haven't spoken to somebody about it, you might at least like to try have a conversation about that. It might help. But a lot of the anxiety, it, it heightens as you heighten. So if you don't fix this part, you ain't gonna fix this part. And as you open, as you up level, as you hit new vibrations and new energies, they are running through a system that has obstructions. Do you get what I'm saying? That's causing a traffic jam, that's making the anxiety worse. As you achieve higher, this is routed through a physical system and an instrument that is blocked. And so there's a reverberating and an intensifying of the anxiety as you hit these higher levels. You want to hit a higher level, but the anxiety is keeping you from it. But it's you going higher in your levels that's causing this reverberating effect. The key for you is fix the physical systems, the traditional stuff. This is what we're talking about. Fix that and your you won't have as much side effects of ascending. You're actually already up-leveling in effect. You're actually already on your way. Keep doing it. You are going to have these effects until you unstuck what is stuck. That's the problem. Does that make sense to you? I hope so. Hey everybody, I just wanted to end by inviting you to my free online spiritual community called The Lightworkers Lab. If you're interested in finding your spiritual tribe, go to thelightworkerslab.com. Check us out, learn what we're about, and learn how you can join. Or just go to Facebook and search The Lightworkers Lab and ask to join. I also wanted to mention that every couple of months I offer an in-depth or a comprehensive spiritual or metaphysical class. And if you're interested in taking your spirituality and your connection to a whole new level, go to crystallandcompton.com slash spiritual hyphen classes. Check out what's coming up and join if you are so inclined. And to everybody, I just want to say that I hope you're having a beautiful day wherever you are on the planet today. God bless.